A rocket. It's like Christmas. Romain Dumas and the Volkswagen IDR Pikes Peak have come to the famous mountain in Colorado for the first time. Pikes Peak, that's the name of the race. And this electric racing car. It's their first day together and the first test drive. The excitement couldn't be bigger. It's completely different to drive. You have no noise, you have no gears. This one, you know, is like a rocket when you go out, uh, out of any corner, as soon as you go on power, you have so much power, it's unbelievable. The anticipation starts building when they first meet in the morning. The IDR Pikes Peak. A purely electric car with 500 kilowatts of power. It accelerates from 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in 2.25 seconds. That's faster than the Formula One. This electric racer on one of the most challenging tracks in the world. It's a hunt for the record. It was uh, amazing, I have to say. It's already very, very fast. Uh, you can already feel the downforce on the fast corner. It's, uh, yeah, it's uh, already a challenge. You know, today was just, uh, let's say, the first time, so I wanted to do a little bit setup on the car. It was very nice and I already enjoy a lot. You know, and the road is very dirty, but uh, a lot of sand and so on, but it was already, yeah, very nice to drive. 19.99 kilometers, 156 turns, 1,440 meters of altitude difference and very thin air on the way up to 4,300 meters. Pikes Peak demands the utmost performance from the driver and the car. The goal? Breaking the record for electric cars. Just under nine minutes is the number to beat on this highly challenging track. It's possible to do it faster, says the pilot. You know, we are here for that, for sure. Uh... We have the, I have the best car and the best team, uh, so normally, you know, we are just here to beat this record. I'm really confident. We have to continue to work. For sure, the project is quite fresh, you know, in terms of uh, the car we just uh, started some uh, weeks ago. So we have to continue to improve step by step. But uh, yeah, it's, we, are, we are getting there, that's for sure. Now it's all about finding the right setup for the car for this record drive. Romain Dumas, he claimed two victories in Le Mans and three more at Pikes Peak. On June 24th, he will start here for the sixth time, but it's his first race with an electric car. The countdown continues. Every day counts and every minute, because at the end, success is all about the details. Pikes Peak in Colorado. Race to the Clouds is what they call the legendary race to the summit of this mountain. It is known as the ultimate challenge, and Volkswagen's IDR Pikes Peak is taking it up. In late 2017, the Volkswagen brand decides to build a car for the most well-known mountain race in the world to compete in the class of fully electric racing cars. The goal, winning the race and breaking the record and going beyond anything that previously existed in this class. However, the designers only have a little over six months to achieve it. The biggest challenge of this project is building a complete racing car in about 200 days, from the initial concept phase to the finished vehicle, including testing. 200 days, that's very ambitious. This is sehr sportlich. Moreover, the IDR Pikes Peak is not only a racing car, but a trailblazer for Volkswagen's new fully electric ID family. So toll. It's so great to build a car like this. It's incredible. Designing and building the first super sports car for a race like this and making it fully electric, that's a dream come true. 
The technology for this race, with its 156 turns, is developed from scratch. And the pilot Volkswagen has chosen is a master of his domain, Romain Dumas, a Frenchman living in Switzerland. He has won the Pikes Peak race three times already. He also won the 24 Hours of Le Mans, twice. Dumas is involved in this project from the beginning, including the car's development. Using a Golf chassis, Dumas tests the new technology on a racetrack. You know, with all this e-motor and, and regeneration and braking, it's, it's, it's completely new for me. You know, so after so many years to learn new things, it's still very nice. The design is finished. In a wind tunnel, engineers fine-tune the car to optimize downforce for higher speeds and corners. Every detail is adapted to the thin air between 2,800 and 4,300 meters, and time is running out. We have less than 100 days now. It's time to finish up, and the pressure is building. It's the middle of April. The engineers introduce the new technology to the car's body for the first time. A critical moment. Everything has to be perfect for the first presentation. On April 22nd, only five months after launching, the IDR Pikes Peak is revealed to the public. Two motors, together delivering 500 kilowatts, that's 680 horsepower. The focus is on lightweight construction. The body and the aerodynamics components of the IDR Pikes Peak are made from an extremely light carbon fiber Kevlar composite. The lengths engineers went to for weight reduction is also reflected in the driver equipment. Even sponsor logos have been printed to save weight on embroidery. As if that weren't enough, the Volkswagen crew will continue tuning the IDR Pikes Peak up to the last second. So on June 24th, the car can show what it can do and prove that all the effort has paid off. <laughs>